The Munadra Initiative promotes vibrant and inclusive public conversations across the Arab world. It empowers youth, women, and marginalized communities through workshops, online competitions, and televised debates, enabling citizens to actively shape policy conversations about the future of their countries, while holding those in power accountable. Since 2012, Al Munadra, the initiative's regional television show, has established itself as the most influential civil society-run independent political talk program on Arabic television, broadcasting 26 live debates from Casablanca to Sana'a. In the debates, winners from online competitions share equal speaking time with well-known policymakers. And, at the end of every season, a large event, DDX, brings together Al Munadra winners, artistically talented youth, and prominent cultural personalities from across the region. Throughout this time, Munadra pursued a unique philosophy to syndicate all of its programs live, simultaneously. Well, you know, across the Arab world, and, and in fact across the world more generally, people are increasingly consuming media in their echo chambers, which is really harmful for our democracy. So it's always been part of our philosophy to broadcast simultaneously on multiple channels to kind of pierce through those bubbles and create um, shared moments of reality for all citizens. But before youth make it to the live show, they go through an online debate competition called Musabaqat Munadara. The competitions radically bring down the barriers for youth to engage in public debate. The Musabaqat Munadra process has been hailed as a disruptive technology for which the initiative was recognized with the prestigious NDI Democracy Award. And to go beyond tech-savvy layers of Arab society, Munadra operates a 15-country community outreach program, providing participants with the debate skills and understanding of argumentation necessary to engage in public debate. More than 13,000 youth were trained by the initiative to date. Unadra broke new ground in 2019 with Tunisia Decides, the region's first series of free and fair parliamentary and presidential debates, hailed internationally as a resounding success. For the first time in Tunisia's history, every single television and radio station broadcast the same signal, creating a unique sense of shared reality among voters. Bringing back the Tunisian president to defend his record on television after 100 days, Munadra broke new ground internationally and set a new standard for democratic accountability. So it's kind of a logical continuation of our work with Al Munadra, which has been running for eight years. And um, you know, we've always thought about how can we create a national debate show that's only for the citizens of a certain country, and Tunisia was just the logical place to start. So that's the idea behind Zama, creating a national forum only for Tunisians. Zam. The program has been a major success on the Tunisian national stage. It is broadcast by five of the country's 12 television stations in addition to 15 radio stations. In 2021, with Zama Town Hall, Munadra introduced a new format for major national policy conversations. <laughs> Munadra also introduced a new format targeting younger adults. Gilles J is a web-only informal conversation that airs ahead of live debates, featuring well-known YouTubers and other influencers. Gilles J tackles similar topics, but is firmly grounded in Gen Z culture and language. Online viewership of Gilles J has exceeded all expectations. Munadra is proud of these achievements, but it's especially proud of the countless youth it has empowered over the years. They are what makes Munadra pursue its mission to foster a vibrant and inclusive public sphere in the Arab world.